here welcome back to the channel and today we are finally doing the Target baby bag review I'm excited this is um, I got this bag I want to say about a month ago so even though we're in quarantine they are still doing the free baby bags um, I suggest just calling ahead to your Target because I don't know about you, but every freaking Target is busy. So I went to two Targets just trying to get this bag. So I suggest doing the registry, even if it's just with your local Target, give them a call and let them know that you want to go pick up your free baby bag. And if they say they don't have it in stock, then just drive to another Target. That's what I did. And then as long as you do that little QR code, you're fine. You don't have to set up two registries. You just let them know that, hey, I need a, the baby bag and the other Target told me to come here. No questions asked, no hassle or anything. So it took me about two months and two Targets just to get this free bag. But I got one with my last pregnancy and I really liked it. So um, you can see I'll put a link above and I just did my bye bye baby review So for my fellow mamas out there if you want to know what's in the target bag and if it's worth it um, I suggest doing any registry is worth it Especially when you get free stuff because hello we're all moms and we all need free stuff So definitely definitely take a look into doing the registries. So this is the bag I got. I got a very cute little teal bag, which I know I'll be reusing. And there, this, I wanna say, just from looking at this bag compared to the last Target bag, there's actually a few more items in this bag compared to, I think I wanna say two years ago. And the first thing I'm just gonna pull out are the Honest Wipes. And this is a 10 wipe pack. And I've heard a lot of good things about Honest, so I'm kind of glad this is in the bag, especially because my son has very sensitive skin. I don't know how my girl's gonna be, so just in case, I'd rather have the sensitive wipes. Let's see, what else is in here? Now, this is adorable. They didn't give any onesies last time. So this is, um, I think this is Carter. Oh wow, this is Carter's. Carter's three month, a cute little onesie. Wow, even if it's just one, I'm just happy to get any type of onesies, especially because I know how fast the babies go through them. So I'm really glad to have that. And that's new, I don't think I've ever gotten a onesie in any of the bags I've reviewed. Um, the next thing is the Boogie Wipes. I believe this is with like pretty much every bag. And then the breastfeeding samples by, um, we go through this guys, every time I do a baby bag review. Lansano, Lans, I want to say it's Lansano, but anyway, the purple brand, um, it is breastfeeding samples inside, so you get two breast milk storage bags and two disposable nursing pads, which is great because I am nursing again this pregnancy. And this time though, I got the um, reusable nursing pads because oh my god, those are a lifesaver and I leaked so much with my first pregnancy. Like I didn't know about breastfeeding and um, the hospital told me to make sure I, they gave me pads but not the reusable ones and I was like, oh, okay, this is cool. But by the time I ran out of it, like literally it was like the movies. My whole shirt was covered and I was just like, wow, I was not expecting to be um, so leaky all the time. So especially going back to work. So definitely, definitely, if you're going to nurse, use the reusable ones. It's totally worth the money, but it's always good to have an extra spare of nursing pads. I usually keep some in my diaper bag and in my purse. And then of course, you know, you get a lot of um, coupons. So this is just from Target and it tells you um, when you download the app, like just as things that you can add to your registry. So along those lines, I have another Pedialyte one, another sample. So 
this is the hydrate with the number one doctor recommended brand for Pedialyte and it gives you a little sample like the, the little things that you put into the water. And then of course you get the little tiny samples. So this one is Johnson's Cotton Touch Newborn Wash and Shampoo. I'm hearing a lot of mixed reviews about Johnson & Johnson because I don't know about you guys, but I heard about that lawsuit, what's going on that's in like the baby shampoo and conditioner and all that stuff. So I don't know if I'm going to continue because I have used Johnson & Johnson before and I don't, I never had a problem with my son. Um, thank goodness, you know, using it. I don't know if I'm going to continue to use it or I might switch to Aveeno, even though it's a little more pricey, but obviously I'd rather have my kids, you know, <laughs> not, not get all those whatever chemicals, whatever, you know, is in there. So I might just switch to Aveeno Baby, which this one is the Aveeno Baby Lotion. And it's paraben free and fragrance free and pediatrician recommended. I love getting these samples because I stocked up on these samples and I stick them all in my diaper bag. Always good to have extra little things in there. And the next thing that we get, I think I believe this is with every bag. This is the Dr. Brown's Natural Flow. It's zero months and it reduces colic, spit up, burping, and gas. I believe with my son we used Tommy Tippy because we did, um, I breastfed but I did freeze milk so that way um, my boyfriend could feed the baby too through a bottle so that way I could sleep. And I think we used Tommy Tippy the whole time. I kind of want to try a vent because I heard a vent was really good. Um, we didn't have any problems with colic, thank goodness. Um, he did spit up a lot though which is why I do want to try the angled bottles. But I did hear Dr. Brown's is good too, and they're pretty pricey, so I'm like, if you're as expensive as they are, I hope they do work, like they say. So I might try this one with Baby Girl, just to see how it works with her. And then you have another one. This is, I never know how to pronounce this one either, but it's the M-A-M -M brand. I'm guessing it's MAM. It looks like there's stuff in here. So it's just a clear little bottle and it's, yeah, that MAM brand and, oh, oh, okay, cool. So there's a little pacifier inside with a little teddy bear and then there's a little, oh, so it's, so it's coupons inside, probably for pacifiers and bottles, which is really nice. I had never really heard of this brand. I mean, I think I've seen it like when I browse through Target, but I've never really heard anything about it. I just thought their bottles were super cute, but I never heard like if it was like anti-colic or anti-gas or anything. I like the nipple shape. I like that it's flat because it reminds me of like the breast nipple. But other than that, I never really heard anything. And then my son didn't even like pacifiers. So, I mean, which is a good thing. So I'm hoping his sister is the same way. And our baby shower, we got a ton of pacifiers and he only used like one for like not even a month. And let's see, before we get to this thing, we have one the last coupon and it is from Aquaphor, which is help protect baby skin from cheek to cheek. So obviously Aquaphor is just like, um, they have multi-purpose ointment, they have rash cream, um, as far as I know, they actually came out with their own um, wash and shampoo. So I don't know if I'm going to be using that one yet, but I'll probably look it up before I um, start buying all of that shampoo and stuff. And the last thing on the list is the Pampers Swaddlers Mom-to-Be Registry Gift. I believe this is with every bag. I'm pretty positive I also got this with my Bye Bye Baby registry bag and it's the same thing so I'm gonna remove this carefully because last time it went everywhere so 
So this time I know how to unwrap it. So this is, I believe, the diaper mat, the diaper changing mat, which I feel like is always good to have a spare because I lost my other one. So now I have two of these guys. So it's just a cute little mat and it has hearts all over it. So it comes with the mat and then it comes with the um, savings booklet, just the coupons on Dread and Dawn, so stuff that you need. Um, I'm gonna try to use the coupons this time because obviously they're gonna save you money, so why not use them? Um, just stuff for Pampers and stuff for the March of Dimes if you want to donate and how to educate on that. And then this one also gives you Pampers Sensitive Wipes. These are the ones I use for my son and I love them. Um, I think I talked about the wipes that I used in my last video where they were too watery based and just wiping his butt, is, it just looked really red patchy marks behind. So the, I think the Pampers Sensitive are my favorite, favorite wipes. And I know in the beginning of quarantine, it was so hard to find wipes. I don't know if you guys were like me, but I was holding on to every single wipe because every store that I went to, they didn't have any wipes because everybody was hogging the wipes. And I'm just like, dang, I'm sorry, but if you're not a parent or if you don't really need these wipes for, you know, for their general purpose and you were just being a hog like with the toilet paper, like that's really messed up because I know a lot of moms, including myself, that need this particular brand for their kids and couldn't even find it. So now that everybody calmed down, um, when I go to Target, I, I buy a box now. I buy one box of, I think there's like, uh, I want to say maybe six bags, like big bags, six or eight bags, but screw it. I buy them now just so I know I have them for my son. And then the last thing in that little sample is a little diaper. And I don't know if it's, I don't know say the, it doesn't say the size. Oh yeah, it is, it's a one. So they give a size one diaper. So that's the diaper bag review from Target. I hope you guys liked it. Definitely pick it up if you haven't already because like I said, we're all moms. We all need free things. Um, I think that's pretty much, I'm debating on doing the Amazon one. I heard for that one, you just sign up for the registry. You have to do 80% of the registry, which means like just adding stuff, you know, to your registry and then spending $10 and then you get that big box and it's like worth $35 and they don't do the little samples. They do like full size bottles of stuff. So I'll probably do that because especially now during quarantine, we have been using Amazon. I, I want to say like, we get packages like every other day here, um, especially because we just moved into the house. So um, yeah, I'll probably do that one just so I can give you guys um, an inside scoop of what's in that box because I always wanted to see what was in there and if they really did give you the full size bottle because I'm like, if you only have to spend 10 bucks, but you do have to be a Prime member. So, you know, there's that too. So if you're already a Prime member and then you want to do spend the $10 and I'm like, why not? I can spend $10 like on Starbucks before and there's nothing. So for to get spend $10 and get a box full of stuff for my baby, I'm totally down. So look out for that video. I'll probably be ordering that within the next couple days. And yeah, thank, that's it. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to head over to my Instagram and don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe. There's lots more videos coming. I'm just trying to get over this, you know, bump of mine and I'll probably do a pregnancy update soon because I'm already in the middle of my second trimester. And if you can tell, I'm already having trouble breathing just doing this whole video. So just like my other mamas out there, we're in the struggle together. <laughs> but anyways, guys, really thank you for watching. I really appreciate it. And until next time, peace. <laughs>